Hello, how you doing? How are you? Hope you're all right. I uh, just thought I would record this video, but first of all, do you like my shark shirt? Look at that. Shall I do it like that, the whole thing, like that? No, maybe not. Maybe not a good idea. Um, anyway, uh, so what I wanted to show you today was um, a flow that I've created, which uh, takes a transcript of a uh, Teams meeting um, it waits until the end of the meeting uh, and, and there's a delay that lasts for about 15 minutes and then we go and get the transcript we truncate it depending on how big it is so that we don't go over uh, the certain token limit within OpenAI um, and then once we've got those chunks we then send it to OpenAI to summarize it and then it comes back to uh, the meeting organizer uh, to check to see whether or not they want to send the meeting notes to everybody and yeah there, there it goes there's an added bit as well but we'll get to that in a minute so this is the flow so I've got a trigger which is when an upcoming event is starting soon we can change this we can add some time in here if you want to um, we've got this chunk variable which basically is a um, the amount of characters we're going to be chunking the transcript into which helps us um, not hit the token limit of 4096 with the with GPT-4. A uh, couple of other things here which we'll get to in a bit. Then it goes and gets my profile. A couple of variables also starting up, uh, being initialized, which we'll also come to in a minute. Then this bit we check to see whether or not it's a Teams meeting. Um, and if it is a Teams meeting, then we come here and we go and get the um, call the graph endpoint um, and the online meetings um, endpoint with the join web URL. Um, hold on, let me just uh, stop someone trying to join my meet. Hey, where are you? Uh, no, that's some other. Uh, so I've got this Otter AI thing, but um, yeah. Anyway, uh, ignore that. Um, yeah, that needs to connect to graph. So I've got like a couple of um, environment variables based on a app registration, which access, gives me access to graph. This gives me the online meeting ID. We then wait for 15, 15 minutes till the end of the meeting. Then we use the online meeting ID to call the graph endpoint again to check to see, uh, to get that transcript. That gives us the transcript ID. And then we pass the transcript ID um, to uh, to the transcription endpoint and that gives us the uh, text version of the transcript itself. This part is um, the do until checking to see how long the transcript content is and it's chunking it into um, into characters um into into it's chunking it into bulks or or batches of 13,500 characters um we then get the result the which has been saved in the um data array we then check its length we then send the prompt which is the prompt to um do the summarization so include key following point, points discussed during the meeting, agenda items, discussion points, decisions made, etc, etc, etc. Again, we check to see if the outputs um, of the, uh, the, the amount of data basically that comes back, if there's only one, um, one, lot, of, um, one lot of characters which is under 13,500, then it's only going to call um, I call the AT, um, open AI transcript endpoint um, once but if it doesn't then it's gonna um, uh, do this call multiple times append it to a string variable and then we're going to get it to summarize it for us as well um, then we set the message content variable to what's come back from here uh, we then send that message content to OpenAI again to um, put it in markdown format. Um, and then we get to this bit where we start and wait for approval. This is where the message content has gone to the meeting organizer, meeting organizer and um, they'll choose whether or not to send the summary to all participants or not. And finally, uh, come down here. 
if the outcome is send summary to all participants, then it sends an email um, with the with the with the message content. Um, there is a bit here which is all about adding stuff to wikis. I'm not going to go into that now, but um, I hope this is cool. Um, I plan to get this up on um, GitHub so that you can um, download it and use it. The only thing I was having a little bit trouble with, which um, I had to kind of hard code here, is the um, is the uh, meeting um, URL. Um, just need to work out how to how to find that programmatically. Um, but apart from that, I should be good to go. All right. Thanks, everyone. I hope you have enjoyed it. And um, I will post this on my blog as well as um, the results that come back from the transcription itself, the summarization, the summarization. Oh, there's quite a lot of words to um, get right here. Hey, right. That's it. Thank you very much. Cheers for watching. Bye bye.